Hello, 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 all my yarny friends. It's Tracy with Critters Crochet, and today is Wednesday. That means it's Battle of the Stitches. And this is the third Wednesday. So if you've been following along, you know that this week is Reveal Week, and we reveal the projects we made. We are working on the alternate stitch this month, and I made an ear warmer. Woohoo! I used it, uh, I made it with a button closure. So that makes it easy to put on and to wear. And so I love how it turned out with the alternate stitch. I think this stitch is beautiful and it's very, it's just an elegant looking stitch and I love it. So I made an ear warmer and um, after this video is put up, I'll have another video shortly after. Um, just look for the title for the tutorial on how to make this. But I wanted to do a separate video to explain Battle of the Stitches because we have several new subscribers, so I'm excited. So Heather approached me, this is our sixth month doing Battle of the Stitches, and uh, she approached me with this and I thought it sounded so fun that I couldn't wait to join in. I said, yes, absolutely, I wanna do this. So what we do is every Wednesday we come on, the first Wednesday of the month, we introduce a new stitch. And let me get my book here so I can show you. We are using this book right here, The Step-by-Step -Step Guide to 200 Crochet Stitches by Tracy Todd Hunter. And we are going through stitch by stitch by stitch in the book each month. And the first Wednesday, we come on and we do a tutorial and introduce the stitch that we're doing for the month and give you a tutorial so you can learn that stitch too. Then the second Wednesday, we come on and we show you a sneak peek of the project that we are creating with that stitch. We are creating our own projects. This is not a pattern that's already out there. This is something that we are creating from that stitch ourselves. And so we will give you a little sneak peek of what we're making and see if you can guess what, what you think we're making with that stitch. Then the third Wednesday, just like today, today is the third Wednesday of September. On the third Wednesday, we come on and we show you the project that we made. After we show you that project in our community tab, we will have a poll put up. And I will have in the poll, I will have Heather's name, my name, and Susie from Crochet, um, Susie's Crochet Chat. She's joining us this month. We will all three be in the poll and you get to vote on whose project you like the best. So that means. After you've watched my tutorial, then you need to go watch Heather's and then go watch Susie's and I'll have their channels linked below so you can go check them out. But you need to watch all three of our videos today, then go to all of our community tabs and cast your vote for your favorite project. Which one did you like the best? Now, we, and then what we will do is we are gonna do a giveaway and someone is going to win the project that got the most votes. So in order for you to be able to be in the uh, giveaway, once you uh, cast your vote in the poll, go below the poll and leave a comment. Just something simple. I voted. Great job. Love the projects. Whatever. It doesn't matter what you say. <laughs> Just something as simple as voted. That's it. Because when you cast your vote, it gives us numbers of how many people voted or a percentage, but it doesn't tell us who voted. So in order for us to have your name to be put in the giveaway to, to get the prize that won the most votes, you have to leave a comment under the poll. So make sure you do that today. Uh, you don't have to do it today, but you will have from today till next Wednesday to get your votes in. And then um, the last Wednesday of the month, the fourth Wednesday, then next Wednesday, all three of us my, on my channel here on Critters Crochet, myself, Susie and Heather, we are going to come on live next Wednesday. And usually that's about 1.30 Central, 2.30 Eastern. I will be sure and post that in the community tab with the exact times to be sure, but that's usually when we do it. So I'm pretty sure it's going to be the same time. But on Critters Crochet at 1.30 Central, 2.30 Eastern, right here on Critters Crochet, all three of us will be on live and we will let you know whose project got the most votes. And then Heather puts all the names into a random wheel and she will spin the wheel to select a winner for that project. Okay, 
So that's how it goes. If there's five, if we ever have a month that has five of them, five Wednesdays, then we will keep the voting open on the third and fourth Wednesday and we'll do the live on the fifth Wednesday. So that's how that works. But we are so excited. We are having so much fun with this. We are so appreciative of the content creators that have already joined in with Battle of the Stitches already. And we would love for more of you to join in with us. So if you would like to participate as a content creator, my email will be in the description box. You can send me an email. You can email Heather or me, either one of us, and let us know that you would like to be part of Battle of the Stitches and what month you would like to join us. Uh, you can join us and do this every month if you want to, or you can pick and choose which month or multiple months that you want to join in. Um, and we can let you know what that stitch is going to be for the month that you want to join. Okay. If you already have the book, that's great. If you don't have the book, we can help you with that. Uh, you don't necessarily have to buy the book. Just if you want to, we can help you with the stitch. Um, but it's real, it's just really handy to have the book. Uh, but you don't have to have the book. We'll help you with that. Um, if you're not a content creator, you're at, and just as a subscriber, you can be involved in this too. We want you to participate also. That's why we put up the tutorials. Watch our tutorial the first Wednesday of the month to see how to make the stitch. And then we'd love for you to create something with that stitch and then send us pictures of what you've made. And we'll be glad to show those pictures on our channel. So far, we haven't had anyone do that. And we would love to get pictures and, and see you guys make something. Um, don't ever second guess yourself and think you can't be creative and make something with a certain stitch because yes, you can. Uh, when I started this, I thought, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this or not. And I have really surprised myself on the things that I've come up with and made with these stitches that I didn't think I'd ever be able to make. So you can do this. So we want you guys to join in. So please let us know that you want to be a part of this and we can explain more to you once you contact us. But we want this just to blow up and go crazy. And we want lots and lots and lots of, uh, of you all to join in with us. So stay tuned today. Another video is going to be coming out after this one where I will give you a tutorial on how you can make this ear warmer. And then don't forget to go cast your votes and vote so that we can have lots of participation. And then join us next Wednesday on the live. I believe that's the 25th and it'll be at 1.30 Central unless I put up something different, but that's usually the time we start. So um, thank you guys for watching me today. Thank you for supporting Critters Crochet. And I will see you in a few back for the tutorial today and um, cast your votes. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you have a wonderful Wednesday and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.